Hey everybody, welcome back. Welcome to episode three of the Patreon podcast. This time I wanted to talk about something that I had, like an idea that I had literally like 30 seconds ago while I was walking to my car. I um, was thinking about trees like I do an embarrassingly am- like large amount of time. I love trees. Trees are really cool. But the idea that trees really have two systems. They have the system of roots, which extracts nutrients out of the ground, and a system of leaves, which extracts nutrients out of the air. And I thought that this was a really interesting analogy when it came to being an artist in general. Um, Because you have your leaves, you have your art projects, that they're big and they're beautiful, and everybody sees them. But you also have a system of roots, which is more focused on the business side of things or your personal life or just mental health. And those are things that are usually kept behind the scenes, something that's usually kept away, not necessarily away from people to protect them, but just because they're, it's your personal life and that's not necessarily something that you want to share. I was thinking that you can't survive if you're just roots and you can't survive if you're just leaves and it's a really interesting dichotomy that a tree presents for this because yes you want to show your work you want to show all your art you want to just be out there all the time and show off everything but then you don't have that structure to your life. You don't have that root system that helps you get strong and helps you grow and be a bigger and better artist. And if you just spend all of your time working on yourself and working on like improving your studio and working on doing all of this background business stuff without actually making anything, then you're also not growing because it's just... (laughs) I lost my train of thought for a second because it's just you're not getting that uh, community reinforcement. You're not building a community. And being an artist these days is a lot about being a community or being a part of a community. I was going to say being a community leader, but that's not necessarily true. Um, so it's it's having that very intentional balance between gathering your energy and your business and your your just artistic your artistic feels from your leaves or the air or just the people around you. And then also making sure that you're grounded in reality to the point where you can, you know, withstand heavy winds. Like if for some reason, and I'm, I'm pushing this metaphor to its limits, I guess, but if for some reason you, there's a strong windstorm or something and you lose a lot of your leaves, if, if you lose your creative energy or your artistic energy for a while, you still have those roots in the ground that will allow you to regrow in the future. And if you have a strong artistic um, community around you and your roots get dis uh disrupted like um you have to move and your studio is all in pieces or something like that you have that community to rally around to help keep your spirits up while you rebuild your root system i think i've stretched this analogy to its limits but i hope you understand what i mean it's a really interesting concept and it's really interesting to look at what you're doing. And, I, and I've been doing this while I was walking to my car. I was looking at all the things that I do that are leaves and all the things that I do that are roots. And it's really cool to kind of see how those balance out. Because usually a tree's root system is very, very dense and diverse. And it goes really deep into the ground to tap into the water and the resources that are available down there. So that's all I have today. I hope this weird, weird tangential idea that I thought of a couple seconds before I started recording uh, resonates with anybody. But I will talk to you guys next week. Thank you so much for being a supporter and have a good one. Be remarkable.